Hey, what's going on everybody? DJ TV here. Thank you for clicking on this video. We are doing a late night toy hunt. Uh, my car had to get looked at. They, the place that I went to did a diagnostic on this car to see what the problem is. Uh, the problem is with this car, when I press on the brakes, you hear metal scratching sound, which is not supposed to happen. So that means something is wrong with my rotors, brake pads, and the caliper. Right? Yes, the caliper too. And that's a, hef a heavy price right there. Uh, so the estimate toll I got for that is like $700, which I do not have to, I don't have to blow right now. I don't have that much money. Seven hundred dollars, like sheesh. That's a lot of extra figures. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I am here at Target right now. Let's go see what they have. We're gonna look for the new legends, the hopefully the Hogan's three pack, which I actually really want to look for, and I want to get because come on, Hulk Hogan, man, this man defined the WWF and the WWE. Because come on, it's Hulk Hogan, baby. Despite of everything outside the ring. Hulk Hogan is the man. Right? Can we agree with that? All right. But anyway, guys, enjoy this toy hunt video. I'll catch you guys inside of Target. And I'm just noticing Target is putting out new toys. Oh, my gosh. Why did... Oh, my God. I thought this looked like uh, Mr. T for a second. But, yo, they're putting out new Mess of the Universe Turtles or something like that. Uh, yeah. Yeah. What the heck? Looks like new figures of turtles. I still have not seen this movie yet. <laughs> but I wanted to show you guys this. Godzilla and Kong, the new empire. What do you guys think of the trailer? I mean, I'm not, gosh. Did somebody rip this? Oh. You could take this apart. And it's like a whole new Zilla under here. Oh, that's interesting. Because he's gonna have like that firepower, right? But then here's uh No, oh, that's Kong with the gauntlet. <laughs> Kong has a gauntlet. Ay ay ay. ay. And is this the villain? But this is saying Battle Roar Kong. Why do they look different? <laughs> no, that's the villain right there. Scott King. Uh, I don't see him here. But yeah, that's gonna be interesting. With this movie. <laughs> well you guys let me know down below Are you guys excited for this alrighty guys in Target they have the new Legend Series 21 line here they have Hulk Hogan which looks pretty decent man I can't lie it looks really good I like the new box where you can see the whole figure and whatnot. we got Mouth of the South Jimmy Hart very nice looking really good here we got Andre the Giant Wrestlemania 2 this is not the chase uh, they got more up here no chase and another Jimmy they don't have the Iron Sheik which is weird but hey I guess somebody was a fan of Iron Sheik and oh my gosh they restocked on Supreme Cody Rhodes. That's interesting. I don't know why. But yeah, that's cool. Something new, finally. <laughs> I do like this Hogan a lot. I think he's my favorite in this set. Guys, we're checking the Marvel Legends real quick. They got the Iron Man Mark II. Iron Man. Oh. <gasps> Stop playing. Yo. Found Spider-Man from Captain America Civil War. That is pretty sick. And I just got his Spider-Man. 
figure from that. This two pack, it looks like they're pushing out. There's Iron Man Mark 46. And here's Captain America from the Winter Soldier. Oh, that's sick. Dang, I wish they would have restocked on the Spider-Mans. That would have been great. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I like Spider-Man a lot. Tobey Maguire is still my go-to, but Tom Holland is second. And, you know, I do like Andrew Garfield, you know. No hate on him. You know, he's solid. Alrighty, guys. Let's go see what Wally World has. Let's do it. Alright, guys. We have made it to the toys section. Let's see what we got. So, it's been a while since I've been here. I haven't seen Jessica Drew in a while. Spider-Man. They still have Egghead? Dude, how come they not have any sales? On these guys. Even on him, on Marvel's boy. Man, I don't know. I don't think they're gonna have anything here. Oh, I lied. Dude, they have the Darth Vader. Oh my gosh. I thought in a million years I would never see this figure on the pig. Dude, I love the Vader with his mask like that. From Return of the Jedi. Look, they got Luke from Boba Fett. Andor. Din. They got another Vader too. Two Vaders in one store. That's wild. Yo, they got some decent vintage carded figures. The Han from Ahsoka, Bubble Fett. That's really cool. Black Series. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. We got for wrestling. Super oh man, the Ultimate AJ Styles. <laughs> so now, the guy that asks why I don't like the Ultimate Editions, I'll say this. The reason why they're cool, don't get me wrong. They are cool to look at. You know, they're unique. If you like them, awesome. The reason why I don't like it is because <clears throat> it's another Mattel line. Same stuff they use for Elites and Basics whatnot, right? But mostly the Elites. Why spend another extra $15 for this? Like, this is what? $30, $35 when Elite is $20, $25. And, you know, it's a little pricey, you know? And inflation is real these days. <laughs> And, um, I don't know. It's just, <laughs> they're not making a lot of guys, you know, if that makes sense. If you see what I'm saying, it's just the more of the expensive part, but that's just me. That's just me. Everybody's different. That's just, the, you know, the reason why I'm not crazy about that. I'm not really crazy about, you know, the body joint and the butterfly arms like that. But I give it to them with the accessories. Some of them. Not all of them, but some. Uh, who else we got? We got this Chris Jericho still here. Warlord. There's another one right here with the TNT title. What set is this one? Oh. I don't do the AWs anymore anyway. Uh, oh, wow. They got this set in, but I am late to the party. Damn, because I do want to get the Jimmy and Jey Uso, maybe Sammy. I do want the Paul Bear, but they have Roxanne Perez. I don't know much about her. I got NXT. I haven't been watching NXT. They got the first time on the line, Aaliyah. It's cool to find. We saw her before. And about this is cool. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Undertaker Batista 2 pack. Dude, their rivalry is one of my favorites. Seriously. But I don't know why Mattel did this. Check this out. Look how his hair is here. How come he has like shaved sides and like. <sighs> it makes no sense. Batista is okay. But man. What set is this? Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> That's cool. But I don't run with basics anymore. But I do want to find the LA Knight. That is cool. I give it to them with fixing the basics in a way with the legs. 
So like how the females have the legs, you could, you know, spread and whatnot. You could do it with the new ones. But I wish, oh my gosh, this would be a dream. If they brought back, you know, you could twist the arms and the ball joint can move up and down where you're able to take off the arm if you boil it in hot water. That is what I miss with basics. The good old days, guys. <laughs> we got Ultimate, Randy, Kurt Angles. I've seen a whole bunch of these now. But not too shab. Not too shab. Just sucks I miss out on Series uh, 106. Because I do want to find the Paul Bear and those. those like I said. But that's alright. You want to let me lose some. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> alright, all right, guys. That's going to be it of this video. This toy hunt was actually interesting so when it came to the marvel legends the infinity saga it's like you know what it's coming back to me because those been out before and i found that exact captain america at burlington but it's just something about the spider-man spider-man is like always hard to get but like we only saw that one spider-man the tom holland spider-man but uh i don't know but it's just cool to see, you know, these Marvel Legends. And I'm just so excited because I saw something the other day. So on Facebook, I'm always in these Facebook groups that like Marvel Legends or wrestling and people show what's coming out, what's being rumored and all this other stuff. So when it comes to the Marvel Legends... I am a huge X-Men fan, Spider-Man fan, things like that. They are planning on making a Fantastic Four Spider-Man and Wolverine. If you guys don't know what comics these are from, whoo, come on, baby. You gotta, you gotta know your knowledge with these comics if you understand, you know? But I did post on my Instagram, uh, like, what comics they're gonna base it off of, and it, it's gonna be cool. Seriously, because there's a Ghost Rider in there. There's, uh, uh, well, there's Hulk. Yeah, it, it gets interesting when you get more deeper into comics. But anyway, guys, uh, we did find the Legends series, the new series, uh, of the Legends of WWE, which is, they look cool. They look cool. They look awesome. Have yet to see the Iron Sheik, but we'll see eventually. Maybe we'll find them, maybe not. I do want to find the Hulk Hogan 3-pack. Because, come on, who doesn't like Hulk Hogan? It's like, yes, I know he has a lot of figures that were made. But a 3-pack like that is, is actually really cool. And they're different Hogans. And I'm a huge fan of Hollywood Hogan. I love the Hollywood Hogan, NWO Hogan. Like, it just, he, he's awesome. Like, that to me. But anyway, guys, you guys see that beautiful stuff up there? Yes. Signed, ringside exclusive of Scott Hall. The fighting moments, Shawn Michaels, when he fought The Undertaker, my favorite match, WrestleMania match ever, and the SCS CM Punk. I have a CM Punk collection down below, which I might want to make a video on. So if you guys want to see that, like this video, and I'll show you guys my... CM Punk collection. Look, you can really see two of them right there. <laughs> but anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, like, share, comment, and subscribe. I love you all. See you next time.